Hello fellow attorneys! Welcome to my Gacha Pull Tracker Guide. The links to the actual tracker are in the description box below. When you open the tracker, at the top, you can see the pull summary and legend. The yellow cells highlight important information, the purple cells are for you to input your pull history, and the gray ones are cells with the formulas that make the tracker work. You only need to copy the gray cells when you make new rows. More on that later. The pull summary is a summary of your stats based on the purple cells below. Now, for the tracker itself, there are two tabs you can use. The first tab, called Per Banner Type, splits each list of pulls based on the banner type. These are Permanent, Rotation, Exclusive Event, Limited Event, and Birthday Banners. Note that you can collapse and expand the sections to make your life a little bit easier. The second tab, called Single Sheet, has all pulls in one list, regardless of banner. The third and fourth tabs are just lookups for cards and banners, respectively. Now, for each list, there are the following Edit Me columns. The Card Pulled column is where you put the name of the cards you pulled. You can also put the number of R cards you pulled instead of each of their individual names for efficiency. For example, here, I can replace Gourmet, which is this loop card, with the number 1. The Date Pulled column is where you put the date you pulled the card. This column is optional. In the Repeat SSR column, you check the cell if it's a repeat SSR so that it won't reset your SSR pity count. The Banner column is a drop-down list for you to choose which banner you pulled on. Next are the Copy Me columns. Card Rarity looks up the card name and finds its corresponding rarity on the Cards sheet. Banner Type looks up the banner name and finds its corresponding banner type on the banner sheet. Counter counts the number of pulls made on that specific row. SR Pity sums the pulls made on Counter column and resets when you get an SR or SSR card. And finally, SSR Pity sums pulls made on the Counter column and resets when you get an SSR card. So, now that you know what things are for, how do you use the sheet and start typing your pulls? First, you create a copy of the sheet. This will let you create your own private copy that you can freely edit. Click on File, make a copy, and then OK. Next, pick which sheet you'd rather use, per banner type or single sheet. Or you can use both if you'd like. Then, you should remove all the sample data on the purple sheets so that you can start typing in your polls. When you run out of space for new polls, you can add more rows above the section's bottom green row. Just right-click and insert rows. Then, copy the formulas in the gray columns from the rows above and paste them on the new rows. That's it! Thank you for watching! This was my first attempt at making a video, so please let me know if it was helpful or if I should just skip the video guide and stick to written guides. If I have any updates or corrections, they'll be in the pinned comments below. This video took me as long to make as the actual tracker did. <laughs> okay, bye!